Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for April 18th of 2024 is titled Facing NGC 1232. So what do we see here? Well, this is an example of a spiral galaxy and it is known by its catalog designation of NGC 1232. And here we see it the very distinct properties of a spiral galaxy. Now this is a large one about 200,000 light years across nearly double the size of our own Milky Way. And we can see the distinct pink color within the spiral arms that is associated with hydrogen gas excited by hot stars. In addition, we see that those spiral arms have a very blue color. The blue color is caused by the light of those hot stars as they have formed within those spiral arms. Now the blue stars that form in the spiral arms never leave them. They don't live for a very long time. So they remain within the spiral arm simply because it would take them too long to move out of them and they will die before that occurs. So those stars never make it out of the spiral arms and they are a good tracer of the spiral arms. We can see very well where the spiral arms are because those blue stars are confined to them for their entire lives. Now that's not the only galaxy we see here we also see a small companion known as NGC 1232 a and well, it looks like these two galaxies may be related to one another with one larger spiral galaxy and one smaller measurements of distance show that the smaller galaxy is actually much farther away. In fact, about six times the distance of the closer larger galaxy. So they just happen to be located in the same general direction in space, but one well beyond the other. So if you could somehow travel the nearly 50 million light years out to NGC 1232, you'd still have another 250 million light years to go to get to the much farther galaxy. Now you might notice there's a little bit of a difference between those two and we'll see that NGC 1232A is actually uh, what we call a barred spiral galaxy. You can see there's kind of a bar going through the center of the galaxy, which is common in many spiral galaxies, although not all of them. Also with NGC 1232, we are seeing it as a face on galaxy. Now that just depends on how the galaxy happens to be orientated towards us, how it is oriented. And we see that galaxy here looking almost straight down on it, giving us a great view of those spiral arms. Now that's not always the case. Sometimes we see galaxies from the edge and spiral galaxies are very thin. So when they turn to the edge, when they're turned to the edge, they look just like almost flat lines in the sky. And you might see one of those galaxies down below NGC 1232. There's another flattened galaxy, much smaller, probably much more distant that we're seeing in an edge on state. So it really just depends on how that galaxy happens to be oriented relative to Earth. It's not something we can change in order to see NGC 1232 from a different perspective. We would have to travel those 50 million light years out to the galaxy to be able to see a different perspective. So that was our picture of the day for April 18th of 2024. It was titled Facing NGC 1232. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture. So until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.